Hello everyone. Now I am going to discuss the question of the poll which I posted yesterday. The question was which of the following statements is incorrect? Options were the first ionization potential of sodium is less than magnesium. The first ionization potential of aluminium is less than magnesium. The second ionization potential of magnesium is greater than sodium. Those who participated, 5% have said the first ionization potential of sodium is less than magnesium. 4% have said the first ionization potential of aluminium is less than magnesium. 70% have said the second ionization potential of magnesium is greater than sodium. 7% have said all the above statements are incorrect. And 14% have said I don't know the concept. Let's discuss the question. Guys, first of all, what is ionization energy? It is the energy required to remove an electron from an isolated gaseous atom. For example, if A is given, gaseous atom is given, and you have converted A into A plus, then energy required is ionization energy. We also call this as ionization potential. Now, when A plus is converted into A plus plus, then the energy required is called second ionization energy. This was first ionization energy or simply we say ionization energy and here it is second ionization energy. In the same manner, when A2 plus is converted into A3 plus, the energy required is called third ionization energy. I1, I2, I3, these are successive ionization energies. Guys, normally what happens, uh, the ionization energy increases across a period. Ionization energy increases across a period, but with some exceptions. The first ionization energy of sodium is about 496 kilojoule per mole. And that of uh, magnesium, it is 737.6 kilojoule per mole. If you write the electronic configuration of sodium, it is 1s2, 2s2, 2p6, 3s1. While electronic configuration of magnesium is 1s2, 2s2, 2p6, 3s2. Now you can see here it is fully filled. But in case of sodium, if you remove this outer electron, the electronic configuration of Na plus becomes what? 1s2, 2s2, 2p6, noble gas configuration. So sodium has a greater tendency to lose electron. As a result, we can say the first ionization energy of sodium will be less than magnesium and data supports this. If I write electronic configuration of Mg+, plus, it is 1s2, 2s2, 2p6, 3s1. Now it will be easy for us to remove electron from Mg+. Plus. So the second ionization energy of Mg will be less than sodium. Now if we check the data, the second ionization energy of sodium is 4562 kilojoule per mole, while that of magnesium it is 1450.7 kilojoule per mole. Guys, in the same manner, we can compare ionization energies of Mg and aluminium. The electronic configuration of aluminium is 1s2, 2s2, 2p6, 3s2, 3p1. While of magnesium, it is 1s2, 2s2, 2p6, 3s2. Now, it is easy for us to remove electron from aluminium. While here it magnesium is fully filled, so it's difficult to remove electron. If you compare aluminium and magnesium, the first ionization energy of aluminium will be less than magnesium. And data supports this. The first ionization energy of aluminium is 577.4 kilojoule per mole. While that of magnesium, it is 737.6 kilojoule per mole. Now the second ionization energy of aluminium will be greater than magnesium. And this will again change. The third ionization energy of magnesium will be greater than aluminium because third electron of aluminium will be 3s1. 
while that of magnesium will be p6 it's tough to remove electron from there so third ionization of energy of magnesium will be greater than aluminium guys congratulations to those who have got the correct answer if you have any doubts you can write in comment section wait for the next poll till then bye bye